The advanced I.O. function makes it possible to work with simulated environments via the control programming in LaSalle Class 2. Keyword Digital Twin The digital twin is an important factor in the Industrial Internet of Things, or IIoT. In the future, this will allow individual machine functions, machine components, or entire machines to be started and tested virtually in the software before the hardware is even available. This results in new possibilities for optimization, such as time and cost efficient prototyping during development, which, for example, leads to significantly reduced project lead times via parallelism. New options for remote maintenance are also opened. Since the status of an active machine or system is reflected in the 3D model, and errors or signs of wear can be observed and analyzed without on-site personnel. The possibilities from the efficiently designed training courses through digital product training, as well as in sales and marketing via product presentations, cannot be underestimated. Currently, LaSalle Class 2 supports a connection to iPhysics from the company Machineering. To enable simulation, identically named IOs are created in LaSalle Class 2. Based on the simulation created in iPhysics, an export file is generated, which defines the correct connection of the hardware IOs to the machine software and is stored in the control project for the corresponding simulation instance, as well as loaded into the target system. In LaSalle Class 2, multiple simulations can be in parallel. For each of these simulations, LaSalle Class 2 creates a simulation project. It is therewith possible to simulate parts of a machine for which the physical hardware does not yet exist. The simulation project is managed in the I.O. Connection Manager. Under the tab Virtual Commissioning Manager, this allows selectively enabling and disabling individual machine components within a simulation in combination with the supported folder structure and multiple selection. With the server Sim Enable in the Advanced I.O. object, whether or not to operate the simulation can be decided per I.O. object. The data can be comfortably read in the simulation objects. Using force mode, it is possible to overwrite the I.O. value. Hardware and simulation values can be thereby influenced. With the data analyzer integrated into LaSalle Class 2, it is possible to record values from advanced I.O. objects. Axis movements, for example, can be comfortably displayed and analyzed.